Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to install the zombie mod pack for f Minecraft version 1.8 and the zombie mod pack is also the fly mod, it has lots of mods inside of it. So the first thing you want to download is the zombie mod pack. The link to that will obviously be in the video description. So once you have opened, once you've downloaded zombie mod pack, open it up with WinRAR and then go to your Minecraft directory by typing in percent update uh, percent into your address bar and then type then click on dot minecraft click on bin then you'll have minecraft.jar I recommend that you back this up just in case something goes wrong and you need to restore uh, a previous version of minecraft without the mod in it because there hasn't been some people that tell me that they get the black screen and you know now I say you know back it up and it isn't my fault if you get the black screen so right click on that click on over with and then win right archiver and then in zombie mod pack you're going to want to click on classes and then highlight all of these and drag and drop into minecraft.jar click ok and then uh, that's done but if you, you'll have a folder called meta meta dash inf delete that otherwise you will get the black screen and now you can exit out of minecraft.jar and then go back up into config Oh yes, yeah. You'll need to go to back into dot Minecraft, and then you need to create a folder called mods. Create a folder called zombie, and then go into the config folder uh, in the mod pack uh, zip file, and then drag and drop all them into there. I'm not going to do it because I've got this from the 1.73 zombie mod. I'm hoping it'll still work. And once you've dragged and dropped them into there, you don't need to worry about the source. You don't need to worry about that. You don't need to worry about that or that. And then that's done. So let's uh, test this out in survival mode. Obviously, in creative mode, there isn't much use for it. You can't use it in creative mode, I I think. I don't see a reason why you won't be able to use it in that. But it's better if we do it in survival, just to... Because you can't normally fly in survival. Right, I am now flying, but I just realized that I forgot to tell you something. So if I just exit out of there. Right. Once you... You can ignore what I'm doing right now. Go back to your... Actually, no, don't ignore it. Go back to your Minecraft file. Go back into mods. Go back into zombie and open up config.txt. You will have... And then if you scroll down to find the fly mod uh, the fly mod here we go yours will look like this yours will look like the one on the right um, fly mod right what you're gonna have to do is just simply delete that that's all you need to do you can see mine on the left does not have it if you delete that it will mean that the fly mod is enabled and then you need to and then if you scroll down you can choose what you want it to do like F toggles fly mode E flies up Q flies down speed modifier is left shift uh, oh no clip mode I didn't know I had no clip um, and then here you can this is a bit confusing um, I wouldn't recommend doing this unless you understand it properly but this basically modifies the speed so it makes it go faster but let's just do this again just to show you I, I did that in my last zombie mod tutorial I forgot about the config file because you don't have to do it with any other mod just the zombie pack because it has a lot of mods in the zombie pack oh god just kind of annoying so now if I push F you can see in the top left corner it said it said here's the UK if I press E, I can go forward, I can go upwards even, and then I can just move around. And if I hold left shift, you can see it moves a bit faster than it usually does in the lags, which is uh, bad. Because 1.8 is quite laggy for me for some reason, don't know why, but but it is. So that's it on how to install the zombie mod pack. Thank you for watching, and hopefully I will see you in the next video.